Everybody dies. What matters is how you die, alone, angry, afraid, or loved to the end as a baby is loved at the beginning. <laughs> Gus, you're a lifesaver. Without my meds, I'm pretty much... Hey. Gus sends his regrets. Just a family thing. But I'm here to take care of you. Well, thanks for this. Well, I couldn't leave you without your meds. Well, you know, if the situation were reversed, you would do the same for me. Gus wouldn't consider you a friend if you didn't have a heart. Yeah, bum one at that. Just ask my cardiologist. You know the thing about doctors? Rafe was in the hospital once. It was a diabetic incident. And the doctors told me that he wasn't going to make it. You didn't listen? Oh, yeah, I listened. And I prayed. And I talked to other doctors. And I researched. And I educated myself. You raised Rafe on your own, didn't you? Yes. Mm -hmm. So see, we have that one thing in common. Did I get everything? Do you need any... <sighs> well, I mean, I don't mean to be rude about this, but why should you care? You mean if you died, I would have one less thing to worry about? I'm not really wired that way. And I'm going to marry Gus, and I'm hoping that his friends and family become my friends and family. So you think we can be friends? I used to hate broccoli. I still do. Yeah. I got this for you. Emma, you got yeah. that? That was nice of you. I, I haven't been able to get out much. And... Well, it's the single mom thing. Sometimes you can take care of your kid, but you can't take care of yourself. Yeah. And vice versa. Well, you know what? The medications, the side effects, and sleepless nights, all that stuff I can handle. But Emma, um, uh, Gus told me that he offered to take Emma, and so I just want you to know that I would take care of her and love her as if she would. Well, don't put me in the ground just yet. I'm not going without a fight. Okay, see? That's more like it. Hey, 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 hey. Slow down, slow down. It's not going anywhere. I know Gus is here. That's why I'm here, Alan. I'm keeping up my end of the deal. Olivia, I've had a change of heart. I was wrong. I don't want you to break up Natalia and Gus, after all. Hey, there you are. What are you, what are you doing out of bed? You're supposed to be in bed. Natalia was going to come over. Uh, she, she did. Stop? She was very, very sweet. But after she left, I just, I had this feeling... Well, I hope it wasn't a bad feeling. No, not that kind of feeling. It's more like a ticking clock. Here. Great. Jewelry, clothing, what, to be divided up equally with Ava and Emma? Yeah. Okay, and assets. Same thing with the Beacon Hotel, to be divided. You don't have a will? I started one with Mel, but I thought, you know, since you're a lawyer, maybe... Well, I'm not, I'm not... Officially, you're, you're a lawyer, but if you want me to talk to Mel, I can do that. Yeah, that would be good and soon, okay? You're not going to do that soon. Yeah, I'm going to live forever. Well, we're working on that. Feeling better? Actually, I couldn't rest, not until I... She wants me to write a will now. You believe this? Well, well, couldn't you just get Alan to do that for you? You know, as part of the deal? What deal? How did Alan know that I was going to be at the cabin by myself the other night when Gus was with you? I don't know. Was he just supposed to keep me busy so that Gus would run to you the night before our wedding? Well, she was in the hospital. I'm not saying that she's faking this illness, but she's sure as hell taking advantage of it. Are you just going to tell me that I'm full of it? No. I can't tell you that. Olivia, wait. wait, wait Why? Wait, wait, Why? Wait, wait. So you can tell me what a rotten person I am? Oh, well, now you're just describing my father. You're right. If it meant saving my son, I would do anything. You're not angry? Oh, I'm angry. I'm, I'm, I'm furious. Are you kidding me? My father with all this talk about an epiphany. Like Alan has to live with Alan. So you need to take care of yourself. So, Do you need a ride? No, thanks. As long as we're okay. 
Give him a hug. Wow. You're very, uh, you're amazing. I didn't do anything. No, you're amazing. You could have 